today I am going to show you how to make this hippie boho bath mat. Now actually this isn't a bath mat, it's a round the toilet mat. Now I like to use those rag rugs, those hippie looking rag rugs that you pick up in markets and things. Those are the kind of rugs that I usually have in my house and those are the kind that I have in my bathroom. But I've never ever been able to find one that is like shaped to go around the toilet. They're always just rectangular. Now we've done the bathroom, I thought it was the perfect time to, to make this rug that I've been thinking about for years. So anyway, we were doing the bathroom, so I took the plunge and had a go, and it turned out exactly how I wanted it to turn out. So, this is how I did it. So these are the things that you're going to need. You need one hippie woven rag rug, a sewing machine and some thread and some really strong scissors and really strong thumb. <laughs> The first thing I did was I took my rectangular shaped bath mat and I folded it over and then I sewed around the open edges. So basically what I had was like one half size mat. The next thing you need to do is measure the base of your toilet. Now mine was nine inches across. So I folded my mat over to find the centre point in my rug and made a little cut. And then I measured four and a half inches either side of that. And I just drew a line up. And then I drew around something circular for the top. Now once you've drawn your toilet base shape, you've got to sew that first because when you cut it, it will fall apart if you haven't already sewn it. So this is probably the most difficult thing I've sewn in ages to be honest and I was really surprised my sewing machine let me do this because it's quite thick. But anyway, you need to sew around the outside line of the shape that you've just drawn. Now once you've done that, that makes all of that bit secure, so that means you can then cut out your shape in the middle and it'll be secure and it won't come apart. Then I just gave a few extra stitches across the fabric just to keep it all together and make it more sturdy. And there you have it. It's a hippie bath mat. Toilet mat. It's a hippie toilet mat. And, get this, it's reversible, it's two hippie bath mats. If you get bored of the colour on one side, you can just flip it over. And it's a different colour on the other side. How brilliant is that? So this was part of my hippie bathroom project. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. I shall see you again next time. Bye!